Jasmine coin. Um, gonna keep this video super brief. Last video I made on Jasmine, it was just kind of my immediate reaction to the Jasmine roadmap that was released, put out in the internet by Hara, the Jasmine CFO. Um, again, I just want to keep these videos as brief and concise as possible. I don't want to waste anyone's time. I'm just making these videos to, you know, kind of put my opinion out there. Um, kind of give you guys my opinion. Let me know in the comments below your opinion on Jasmine. Uh, 0.02236 at the time of this video, just around two cents here. Uh, over the last seven days, I don't think we got significant. I mean, we got significant price action after the roadmap was released, obviously. But even up to leading up to the roadmap being released, we were seeing significant price action. I think we just didn't see a tank in price, right? Roadmap got released, I think, on the 23rd. So again, it got released around two cents. We're sitting at around 0 0.022. So nothing crazy, but nothing bad in, in regards to the roadmap being released. I think. If there was some more, and again, this is not me spreading FUD and negativity about Jasmine. It's just me being real in the circumstances and kind of real in what is going on with Jasmine, in my opinion, in my opinion only. Uh, if we did get some more substantial catalysts in that roadmap, I definitely think Jasmine could have seen some positive price action. Now, if you're looking to DCA and continue to DCA into Jasmine, then you do like these price points, right? I think these price points um, benefit those who are looking to obviously still DCA into this project. Um, but Hara, right, puts out, or this tweet here, Hara retweets this tweet by Jasmine Management. Here is the roadmap for 2024. He's going to talk about it in the detail, in details, in AMA, in the Jasmine official telegram um, in two days, I believe. So the 27th. So two days. This is a little bit of more of a uh, more in-depth breakdown, essentially. Um, right. And you can see like some of these tweets here. Very unprofessional for a billion dollar market cap project. The roadmap design looks ugly and there are multiple delays in English typos. Again, what I was alluding to, right? I alluded to how the roadmap itself, not that it matters too, too much, but the aesthetic of the roadmap that Hara, uh, Hara put out is like, I mean, you you would think that they could put out a better roadmap, just easier to read and just a little bit more visually appealing, right? And I'm not, I guess I'm not the only one who thinks that. Now, I was getting comments and things like that on my previous video talking about Jasmine, but let's be real here, guys. Like, this is like, what is this? What really is this? This is a coin that has a 1.09 billion dollar market cap that sees 133 plus million dollars in trading over a 24 hour period and this is the type of roadmap they put out right and again i want to be excited about jasmine right i want there to be bullish catalysts 100 percent, i do it's not even about you know me not believing in it i i mean without question there's obvious potential in jasmine right we're talking about a billion dollar market cap coin etc etc and i've alluded to it before i've alluded to it before you guys the lockup needs to happen. I think everyone knows that the lockup needs to happen. Again, we're getting a $100 million lockup, essentially, what they're saying here. Um, exchange linked lockup feature quarter one, 100 million lockup, Jasmine, April quarter one, right? No real specifics in regards to it, right? Um, and then you can see here, there's a, a B BSCN article here, Jasmine revealing the roadmap. I think Jasmine works directly with this publication because a lot of retweets from Hara come from this publication here. Um, but on the bright side, right, I don't want to be too negative in regards to what I'm talking about here, Jasmine, because I do think that there are aspects of the roadmap that are bullish, right? Obviously, this, uh, the credit, the credit, uh, thing that they have, where is that at? Um, hold on, let me go to it where the carbon credit exchange, sorry, they're looking to establish basic exchange functions in quarter one and quarter two. The protocol will then implement a credit offset mechanism through token burns, which again, will we're going to have to wait and see, in my opinion, on, on those uh, aspects of the roadmap. And then Jasmine will apply for a voluntary market of the same standards in quarter three, quarter four. And the team looks to obtain a J credit certification by quarter four. They're going to uh, launch the test net and facilitate limited trading activities in quarter four. And the protocol will collaborate on a credit linkage through blockchain PCs through during quarter three and quarter four. Hara is saying in 2024, they want to specifically focus on data integration with devices. As a step in this direction, they decided to collaborate with a global company that has a large amount of data, right? Again, they could, I'm not blaming them for not talking about which company this is, right? I think they, uh, the roadmap says world-class, world-class company is what the roadmap says, I believe. Um, I don't blame them for not saying it, but it's a little vague. It's a little vague in my opinion. Um, again, I, we're going to have to see what Hara says uh, in the AMA. And then again, you guys, this is just my opinion. This is just me talking about this and um, just giving my reaction. I think that 
there's too many people that will you know are too too bullish on projects or not that i'm not bullish right i don't want to put that out there i just want to be realistic you guys i think there's a lot of fake uh claims and just unrealistic types of videos on youtube talking about jasmine coin and other crypto specifically not even specifically about jasmine but again let me know in the comments you guys it, Honestly, let me know in the comments below if you read that roadmap and you felt more bullish than you already did, right? If you were bullish on Jasmine, you have conviction and you believe in this project, you were bullish already, right? If that roadmap after reading it made you more bullish and made you super confident in the bull bullish outlook of this project, let me know in the comments below. I'm really interested to hear what you guys have to say about that. Um, again, some positive news on the spectrum. Put a link to this tweet in the description below. I guess Jasmine, Japanese companies can now hodl crypto without incurring a tax burden starting in April of this year. This is straight from Binance. Um, so hopefully this ends up being, I know this came out in December, but hopefully that is some sort of catalyst that can propel Jasmine to the next stages here um, as we, you know, we're going to enter quarter one of the Japanese fiscal year. So again, drop a like on this video, you guys. Hit that subscribe button. And as always, have a great day.